Hey, fishy jerks. Nice day. It's uh, late October and it's 70 degrees today, which is crazy. So, very nice. Getting outside. Uh, lots of fry in the pond. Lots of uh, golden white cloud minnow fry. Tons of them. Tons of them. Next year, I'm going to have to actually uh, move some out, I think. Because uh, we've got quite a few in here now. Uh, so the colony is definitely doing well. I mean, there are some tiny little guys in here. I don't know if you can see them or not. Uh, beautiful, though. The bigger guys are just beautiful. Beautiful fish. Uh, the water is very murky because I just um, I just cleaned out the top piece. That gets shut off. Uh, the, actually, this de-icer is in the water already. This is, um, yeah, and it's warm to the touch. It's a de-icer, not a heater, which is weird i mean it's got to heat up right but it it keeps the water at 40 degrees and again we're in upstate new york so um that keeps it from freezing and that uh that did a good job for them last year they they obviously survived and thrived and they're doing well and look i got a very late season bloom uh it looks very washed out but it's still cool to get a bloom i didn't cut all of the lily pads uh i cut it most of them just left a few because we still have days like this, you know, where it's 70 and sunny. I figured it would still give it good energy for the uh, the winter. But again, look at all the white clouds in here. Lots of them. It's just some beautiful colors on them too. Beautiful, beautiful colors. They really got that golden color, but a lot of red and neon blue white just uh just beautiful fish absolutely love these little golden white clouds so anyways uh that's the pond just about i gotta clean this all the way out this year uh the creeping jenny actually fell into the water and uh it was growing really good in the water it's growing very well right in the water i'm gonna take these little bits inside and just see what they do I'm sure some of you plant experts can tell me that's a good idea or a bad idea, but I'm going to just check it out anyways. Still got lots of blooms on this. Again, for late October, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, froggy. Lots of those little uh, green tree frogs in here. I would hazard a guess to say there's one over here. I would hazard a guess to say there's probably seven of them. Uh, again, they don't seem to be bothering the white clouds. You can see there's some very, very small minnows there. Uh, very, very small fry. Tiny little guys. And uh, they don't seem to be bothering them. So I think they're just a good addition to the, uh, the little ecosystem that's going on here. Really digging this pond, though. This is our second winter with it. And uh, I think it's coming along. I think it's ready for the expansion that's going to happen. Again, we are cutting a hole right about here. Because this property slopes big time. So over there, you know, the soil is up pretty high. But over here, it's pretty low on the other side of these blocks. I mean, it's, it's, it's a good, there's probably a good 8-inch difference right there. So the pipe can come out here, and then we're going to dig all of this out to be uh, more of a pond. I'll put a pond liner in there, maybe make it a good, you know, three foot deep. Probably I'm looking at about, um, probably about a, a six foot by four foot by three foot deep. So we'll start working on that next spring. It doesn't mean we'll finish it next spring, <laughs> but we'll start working on it and uh, see where we get with it. So it'll really expand this pond. Ooh. Hello. You wanted to say hello to us. You done? You got anything more to say? All right. All right. Well, thanks for watching. So, yeah, success. I think uh, I think the pond is a big success, and I absolutely love it. I enjoyed the hell out of it this summer. And um, I, I can't wait to do more with it next year. I really think it's got a good, uh, strong uh, base now, and uh, it's time to expand it.
Look at those guys. Just beautiful. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you.